Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Journey of Life. And here we are on the beautiful river banks here, um, just enjoying the morning sunrise coming up over the mountain and trees there. Oh, it looks like a bit of a cloudy day. That's cool though, eh? Beautiful, beautiful game. Love it. Okay, uh, today what we're going to do is by the end of this episode, I hope, I know it's a tall bill, I think, to fit into 40 minutes or so, is try and have iron tools by the end of this episode. Um, so in order to do that, we need to finish off this woodworks. So we've got to place the woodworks, build the woodworks, and interact with it, right? We got the saw. We got the saw. So now we've got to make the woodwork. So let's dump some of this crap off on the table here. We don't need to be carrying all this stuff with us. Um, I think we're just going to need, we're not going to need the shovel right now. We can just put that down here. I don't want it hitting stuff and exploding all over the place. I was a little leery of that right there. I'm like, ooh, what's that going to happen? Anyway, you'll see what happens sometimes. The, the physics, I mean, it's an alpha, okay? So, um, actually, I don't want to put the sticks down there. Why am I doing this right now? I don't want to do inventory management. But it is a part of the game that um, you can't ignore at first because you only have the 12 inventory slots, right? Plus your hands. So, yeah. uh, Okay, let's do this. We want to build this woodworks. Oh, I guess we should... Uh, interact with this to get the station planted so to speak <laughs> placed where are you there you are okay so let's place this so we want to do this we haven't placed one right yeah we didn't do that earlier okay so we want to place this really anywhere right now and I'll just move it when I build the uh, sawmill, I think uh, anywhere, anywhere, somewhere where it's not so in the bushes, good enough, right here. Okay, so we need um, 10 1 meter logs and 1 2 meter logs, a bunch of fiber rope, and the saw. We also need to eat, so let's just do this. Do the use all, we're okay for now, okay. Okay, so I think instead of chopping down these river trees here, whatever, what are these called again? These are the Apello tree pine. They're not worth the effort. They drop like one log. You know what's worth the effort? These peony, <laughs> these stupid little broad leaves here. They they rock. Watch this. Well, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 hits with the wood axe. So remember that. 14 hits to take out a broadleaf with a with a wood axe. Let's grab these. We're just going to chop those in half, and that'll give us our 10. But that's not going to be enough. We're going to have to get another one. Well, we could chop down one of these guys, I guess. So we've got to throw these on the ground. And chop them in half. That's fine. Just want to separate them a bit because that. <laughs> Gosh, that's fine. Okay. Okay, so we should be able to just whack a do, whack them all these <laughs> in half. There we go, perfectly in half, a nice and smooth cut. This wood axe rocks. Okay. <clears throat> Sometimes I get overzealous, especially with the iron weapon and the other save that I have. Ooh, ooh. And just like I did there, you hit an extra time and you break a stick or something too much. It can happen. I think I did it on last episode. <clears throat> okay. Hmm. 
Well, this guy seems to be in the way right now. Let's just chop him down. Use him as the centerpiece because these pines don't yield squat for the effort, let me tell you. Come on. Oh, and what do we get? We're going to get one. One. Like I say. Woohoo! Well, that's all we needed. Uh, we've got the rope on us and the saw blade. We should be able to make this now. Okay. There we go. And bam! We've got the saw works. Now we just got to interact with it. And we are done. And that is done. We are done the tutorial section of the um, game, so to speak. So this gets us up to the point where we can make planks. So if you look here, we can just take a two meter log to create one plank. So not very efficient. Uh, one meter out of one meter logs. And then we can also turn a two meter plank into two one meter planks. So this is the most common thing that I end up using it for eventually, especially with a sawmill. I usually have it right beside the output of the sawmill. And then you can just spin up um, one meter planks really quickly. Yep. Anyway, I'll show you all that. Uh, I don't know much of the game past getting up to like a stage two settlement tell you the truth so uh, we're going to be discovering the game together eventually especially the end game content okay let's get the next thing going is we need to make the handles for the iron tools so where's our son we're doing okay we got the saw up so we need to make a bunch of planks right because let's take a look to see what the lathe requires so the lathe down where the heck are you there you go okay so let's place this thing it requires power we're gonna have to make a ton of gear for this thing uh, okay so we can get it started though but let's place it um so it has it has a we need we need i'm gonna put some uh wind power going and i i think um I like I like actually having it fairly close to the workstation actually. You know what we should be able to we should be able to get away with I might have to keep chopping that tree down or something, but <laughs> it is kind of in the way. That tree is very annoying right there. Maybe I can put the lathe over here. Actually I'm gonna try it here. This might work just fine here. Okay. Okay. So now that we have the the blueprint location scoped out where we're going to build the lathe. Uh, we need all these two meter planks. We need one one third gear, one one to one gear, and five nails. So that's the total amount of items required to build this thing, I believe. Yeah, okay. So we can, in order to get the um, gears going i can do that with the table but i need what i want to do first is is really quickly set up a chopping block i find this actually quite the handy little thing right at the beginning of right right after setting up the uh uh woodworks really so the firewood station uh that'll help with so that we don't have to gather so much frickin' uh, uh, sticks anymore. I find this to be quite handy. I am deviating a little bit from the uh, lathe plan, but it all comes to fr fruition real quick here. I'm gonna, it's because of the placement. I want to make sure where the lathe is is not going to be too bad here for placement. So right about here. <clears throat> I think we should be able to utilize all three areas with the 
with the firewood station, I can always move that if it's not quite in sync. I can move stuff around, right? So it's very cool. Uh, let's get this stuff together. We're, we're going to need a bunch of logs. So let's uh, whack down some of these broad leaf here. It's fine. We can just get these little ones. They yield. Oops, not with the hammer. Can't really. Uh, I think you're allowed one chop with the hammer. <laughs> and then it's like, nope. Thatch is nice. We're going to have to get some food here, too. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's grab that. Grab that. All the rope. All the rope you can. You know, we're just going to whack. We're going to whack one of these coconuts. Oh, it's rotten. Okay, so at this point, I can either... I think I can try cooking it if I made a soup pot. In order to make a soup pot, I need a pottery station. I'm not going to do that right now. I want to get some iron tools going, but I can still eat this if I hack it, hack one in two, and then it drops just like coconut half, so it's not like spoiled anymore. <laughs> and then, so we can pick that up, and if we use that, use all on that, it like boosts up both, so we're okay. I'm going to chop another one here and just grab that really quick and use and actually I'll just wait for my uh, fluid levels to go down a bit use that get the most out of it okay let's keep going we need to drop off all our oops drop off all of our logs here so I'm just gonna actually I'm this is a stupid place to drop these you know what I'm gonna move this a little bit closer I think Let's just move this closer. Let's just move it there for now. It's fine. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, so we need all these planks. So let's do this. Is it Was it planks? It was planks, wasn't it, for the lathe? I was looking at that. Yeah. 10 2 meter plank. Okay. Not log, plank. Okay. So we need, we can only make five. Fine, whatever. We can walk away now. It's got the logs. See how it grabbed all the logs on my arm and threw it on the ground? So we don't have to worry about that right now. Oh, see that? A snake. A snake. Big snake. That's okay. They can't do anything to us. <laughs> I'm not so freaked out by them anymore since I have been playing it on off camera. Okay, let's keep going. We need to chop down some trees. There's another little broadleaf over here. It's got a big pop of one too we can take down. Now the trees do grow back, so it's not that big of a deal. But they won't grow back underneath a base of some sort. So, if you have a building, it won't grow back. Aha! Uh -huh, tool's broken. Okay, I was waiting for that. So, we broke our tool. Okay, well, I guess we have to deal with that. I did make another one. Where are you? On the ground here. Okay. So, we can actually repair that if we want to make a... Um, a grindstone and you know what we we do have everything here I think to do that with so I don't see why not um, although I think we need the sticks so I'm not gonna bother right now let's just oh you know what hmm no we need to because if we wear out this axe we won't have a way of chop, chopping down well I don't really need to chop down this stuff with the axe I can use my hands not a big deal. We should go get some fruit trees here really quick. If we're going to make a grinding wheel, we might as well go grab some fruit trees then. Okay, so that has no fruit on it. Let's go check out. This one looks like it has fruit. There we go. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, so the other thing too is... If we get a pottery station up pretty quick, uh, then we can actually start 
excuse me. Uh, we can start. I got a frog in my throat here. Just give me a second. Sorry about that. I had to take a drink of some sweet tea. Okay. Uh, so here we go. Let's pick up the fruit. And how much is that going to give us? Let's see. Let's just do a use all. Not that much in food. Not that much. So eating it outright doesn't give you a lot in food. It gives you a lot of water. But what I found is when you eventually cook it in a soup pot, and make jam out of it. It actually gives you a lot of food. It's kind of food and water. So it's way better. Um, did we get enough here? Uh, let's see, six, that's 12, plus nine. <clears throat> yeah, that's a ton. We don't need more. <laughs> here, let's chop a tree on the way back. And. Yeah, I just wanted to uh, get some sticks there first to before we ran out of, uh, before we break this axe anyway. Although it's not going down that fast. So it's, we've got some life out of this axe. Yep, oh, and we are full. Pick up as much as that. Okay. Should probably spin up that fiber. That's okay. Let's just run back. Dump this stuff off. Um, the birch and the we'll make the um, make the grinder, make the grinder or somewhere maybe right here. Let's do let's set up a grinder grinding station grindstone. Let's put that at the end of the table here. We'll just spin it, it's fine, good enough for now. Okay, straight solid stick and fiber rope, and then it needs other stuff, so yeah, we can do that. We've got it on us, we've got the hammer on us. And bamboo, one meter bamboo, and a stone wheel. Okay, let's drop these logs off. Okay, oops. Careful not to knock stuff around. Um, so let's grab a stone and because we're going to make the grinding wheel, and then we got to chop down some bamboo, some bamboo right there. <clears throat> oops. Oops. Yeah, not with the hammer. Why do I keep doing that? There we go for at least it's stacking in twos now. Okay. Let's go. Uh, I'm going to spin that so it doesn't roll into the river. There's no kidding, I bet you it probably would. <laughs> that would suck. Okay. Um, yeah, you too. I'm going to spin you too. There we go. Let's chop one of these. Okay. There we go. And then we need to make the wheel. So, what is that? Is that a craftable? Yep, stone wheel, there we go. Craft that. Okay. And now we should be able to just pop this thing in. Boom, we got a grindstone. Uh, we can... We can equip the primitive axe now. Oops, I missed it. Equip the primitive axe. And then we just hit E when we have it equipped. And you can see it gives that little sharpening icon and it shows it to be sharpening the edge. 
and I weighed a little bit because it usually isn't fully sharpened. Well, you can actually see it going up. There you go. Boom. Done. <clears throat> okay. Um, so we have a way to fix our stone weapons, which is actually also useful for the iron weapons here. Our iron tools and weapons to sharpen them. So I don't know if we're gonna get this done. We gotta get this done. Let's get this done. No, I don't. I don't want the bush. There we go. The wood works. So we want more of these. Get you going. Okay. Oops. We can just throw all these sticks down. We can use them for firewood or whatnot. Get this rope going. Keep on top of the fiber. Okay. So let's get the wooden gears going and the nails going. Whew. Uh, nails. Do we actually have... We have the two-handed saw baked, so let's make the nails. Oops. Make some nails. Nails. Craft that. Okay, we got to take that over to the fireplace here. And then stoke up the fire. So let's do that really quick. Okay, so while that's stoking up, we can um, we can grab all. Well, it might be close enough. Let's just let's just put the hammer in our hands here and try whacking this. Yep. Oh, right. We need one more plank. Okay. Um, and then this should be baked by now, right? Yep. Okay, we can go put this over here. I'm going to go get another log. And then we'll get this going. So that is going to need one iron nugget. That's not that bad. We've got lots. We've got lots. Okay. Oh, that literally was only one nugget. Usually it's a whole stack that I... There we go. Six. Okay. Because I want to make a... You know, that only makes three, I need five, right? So let's put one in there. We've got to get this fuel. It is fueled up. Okay, so we'll just light it. Okay, well, that's cooking. Let's go chop down one more tree here. I want to get a few logs. I don't want to just get one. So we'll go after the broadleaf here. And come on, you can do it. You can do it. Oh my! And they all fall in my head. Ouch! Oh, concussed. That's okay. We grab them all and run back. That was six off that. Okay, I need to chop one of them up to make uh, the. shorter logs and we're going to chop one of these up to make the one meters okay so now we can actually really quickly make this let's pound that in there we go it's done it used up one of those okay so now we have enough to actually make the craftable is it uh yeah it's in here so we needed a one by one and a one by three. We'll have to come back to that. It's so slow to craft those. <clears throat> okay. So let's grab the nails out of here because they'll be, yeah, they'll be done. I know I'm not showing you the uh, animation and all that right now. I'm just trying to get as much done during the sunlight here, right? Because because that is our enemy is the darkness so um we're kind of stuck to the sun okay why am i putting all five in that was 
ridiculous. Let's put one in. Because <laughs> that's all it needs. Okay, so we'll let it do its thing. And then that is crafted, that one wheel. We need the other one going now. Okay. So we need a one by three to craft that. Okay, let's look into what... So that's the gears and nails, the plank. Let's grab, we've got the wood on us. Let's throw these logs down, get the plank built. I think I'll just plank up all those right now. Let's just do that. Okay. And then... Okay, so once that has a plank, we can have the other gears and the nails should be ready now. Excellent. There we go. We can turn this off right now. We'll just turn this off right now because I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Okay. Uh, oh, you know what? Let's turn this off too because I'm not ready. <laughs> So what is the next thing? Let's see. Let's pound this in. Are we close enough? No. Let's stand over here. Come on. Can we get it now? Yep. Do we have the five? We've got the five nails on us. Yep. Boom. There we go. The lay. Okay. And it's starting to get dark. Well, the sun's starting to go down. So now is the connector pieces for the power let's get that going and that is this piece right here this horizontal let's it'll snap into place where it wants to go so it wants to go right there let's put it there and we need straight and short and fiber rope i think we might reach everything from here oh it needs to be, yeah, I know it does. Did we run out of? Okay, so let's um, let's smash this one. We'll get some solid stick out of that. Do I need to uh, pick it up? I might have to pick here. Let's just pick it up. I don't want to screw around right now. Let's get this done. And then we will need the one meter log and two of the one to one gears. Damn. Okay. Two one to one. I should have had those going. Should have had those going. And we're going to have to make more of those too for the power source. I don't know if we're good. This was a tall, tall order to try and get this running in one episode. Um, okay. Now I'm panicking because I can't do it. No. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's frame this out. Get the windmill up too. Because that'll snap in there. Yep. And then the bamboo will get the get the uh, wooden gears, get those going. Um, and then what else did it need? It needed the one meter bamboo log. We have that right over right over here. Okay. <clears throat> But that thing actually needs the big the big ones too. Let's just grab all three of those there. We can actually start hammering those in too. While we're waiting for the gears to craft. Ooh, come on. Is that it? Did we get them all? Yeah. Okay. So let's go. We're, we're going to need a bunch of bamboo. So let's just. All those gears are crafting. Bamboo, bamboo, bamboo. Where are you? There you are. See some. Bunch of them. Okay. Oh, it's just noticing my health. It's going to start complaining soon. Oh, did I break one? No. Nope. Good. Okay. Ooh, that was five out of that one. Uh, actually, just let's let's do a use all to get it. Yeah. Perfect. Nice. Um, here, let's chop this one down too. I have a feeling we're just going to need it all here. Come on. Oh, I'm not going to be able to carry it all though. 
Oh, I did. Sweet. Okay. Okay, so let's hammer this stuff in. Um, did I not grab the short? Did I did I already hammer that in? Did I hammer the? Yeah, it just needs the gears. Okay. And is that two of them there? That's one. That's just one. Can I not pick it up? Oh, no, I'm full. Okay. You know what? Uh, here, let's throw down some bamboo here. Let's get it out of my inventory. It's quivering. Not sure if I like quivering bamboo. Okay. And we need. Oh. Oh, that was two. That was two. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, okay, so let's smash one of these. Okay. And then we got a. Hammer that in. Come on. Can you not do this? Yeah, I know that. Um, no, it's fine. Do I not have the... Oh, I didn't grab... It's on my... Close enough. derp a derp because I couldn't grab it, right? Okay. Quit wasting time. Come on. Get that in there. Come on. You can do it. Why? Why didn't it? But it was two. Didn't it say two? I thought it... <sighs> Fine. Did I not... No, I picked up two. Uh, okay, well, it's still on me. Um, no, it's not on me. Where the hell is that? That's on the ground somewhere? Let's grab that. <laughs> That's why. Okay, I... Whatever. I thought I picked up both. There we go. Okay, so the horizontal connector is... Up, let's smash that in. Let's keep pounding stuff in. Just keep pounding, keep pounding. Uh, we ran out of bamboo stuff by the look of it. What do we need? Come on. One meter, four one meter, and more fiber rope. Okay, so we need to smash that guy and that guy. Okay. Oops. I smashed the other one too. That's okay. We're going to need it. We're going to need it. So let's keep pounding this in. And then the rope. And now it wants more bamboo and rope. And now it wants... Oh! It wants... Hang on. Stop. Thank you. Um, one meter. Fiber rope. And two more one-to-one -one wooden gears. Okay. So we need to chop this. And then, oh, and then we need to wooden gear it up here. So two more. I think we're even going to need two more again after this. Um, here, let's put this iron down. It's, it's just too heavy. It's heavy, man. Okay. <clears throat> gears. We need the gears. Yeah. We need the gears. And then it needs a one meter. One meter. So let's smash this guy. And again. There we go. And so now let's see what we need on this. And the two times wooden gear. That's one of them. That's all it's made so far. Okay. Okay. Oh, nope, there's the other one. Excellent. And now it wants those leaves, so we need to get some... Oh, we had some laying close by. Okay, so we need leaves, uh, rope, and another wooden gear. So let's get that going. Craft that. 
and then we'll go pick some leaves here. Uh, where did I see those? Right here. Bunch of them. So we can, oh no, not smash with the hammer. We can just cut them down with the axe fairly quickly. Grab the fiber, obviously. You can see how we went through all that rope already that that we had crafted up. Okay. That was a ton of leaves. Come on, pick it all up. There we go. And that's tons. Okay, but that's okay. I know what to do with the leaves. Which we'll be doing fairly quickly is growing some, is making some farm plots actually. Okay, so let's hammer this in. While the sun's starting to go down. And you can see down in the corner there it's saying, oh, we just one, there we go, and another log and the gear. The gear. Where's the gear? Give it the gear. We're going to give it the gear. Here we go. Last piece. And there we go. It's spinning, and the lathe is spinning, and it's got RPM to it. Yay! We can make stuff. Okay, so let's see if we can do this before the end of the episode. Uh, what do we need? Let's make let's make an axe. Let's make a real freaking axe. Yes. Okay, so let's make the felling axe. Felling axe type one to chop down trees. So we want to craft one of those molds. And then we're gonna go kick cook that up. Okay, let's get all this crap out of us here. I need a D fiber. So let's do that. Get this rope going. Okay. And we got to cook this mold. So let's get the mold cooked. We'll light this back up. Uh, we should give it some more. Here, just throw that stick on. I don't care. Um, okay. So while we're doing that, we need to lathe up the handle <laughs> sorry i had a had a ladybug crawling on me there making me all ticklish so let's use this log here to do that with because it's right beside us so we're going to make the long handle uh, we want the one that does a lot of damage to trees so that one that not as much that not not at all it's more just plants and that's a little bit to trees. So you can see they have different uh, values, right? So stamina, range, attack speed, all that. I want to optimize the damage on trees. And that is this one. So let's craft that up. There we go. Uh, another thing that we need to make, hopefully we have all the stuff to do it, is we got to do the tool station. I believe that's what it's called, right? Tool something, tool, tool workbench. Okay, and we're just going to do an extension right off the end here. Right there is fine. And it needs a bunch of planks so we, and nails. Okay, so we need more nails. Damn, so I can't even put it to, oh, look at the sun is, mm. okay, so can we do this? We need We need to cook some more nails, so let's do nails. Let's do nails really quick, and then we'll get these planks going. So, I'm really close, eh? <laughs> really freaking close. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. We don't need all that. We don't need all that. Just, just one. Don't derp. Okay, start you up. Now, does that have enough fuel? Let's, um... Can I reach some fuel? Some of these sticks. That'll work. Okay. So that'll spit out some more nails. We need a, another round of those nails too because we need five, right? So logs or plank. What was it? Planks? Planks. So ten planks. So let's get some logs really quick. Well, we have light. So let's cut down a big tree while the sun's going down. Gonna try and get this. We're gonna try and get this actually 
built this episode. I know it's a huge task to do from where we were without even a workbench up. And I kind of dawdled a bit, unfortunately. Come on, where are you? Are you all going to fall on my head now? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, oh, I should have dropped all that crap off. That's fine. Let's just get these planks going. And give me, and I'll just, oh, yeah, let me go to that menu. Thank you. Let's drop a bunch of this crap off. I can't, uh, actually, here, let's grab these. Keep this going, all right? One last time. That'll give us our enough nails. Okay, that should be good. Excellent. And that clay mold will bust. Okay, so let's get another tree chopped. And we can grab... Oh, I see, I, I don't need all this crap on me. <laughs> Running out of light. And I'm wasting time. Okay, we can pick up these logs. Or this log. Um, I'm not going to worry about anything else right now. Just give me logs. Oh, it'd be nice to have that axe. Come on. Sun's going down. Come on. Come on. Fall on my head. Thank you. Is that it? Five? That's enough. That's enough. That's good enough. That's good enough. As that thing saws away. Um, you know, we'll just drop it all off here. Oops, it's going to fling them. Yeah, that was silly. Okay, go over here then. Go there. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops-a-daisy. Shouldn't have done that. Uh, yeah, you don't want to put it underneath, placing it underneath things. I should have just spun it. That's fine. Okay. How many do we have? Four? Why did it not make any? Like, what the hell? Okay, let's get this going here. We've got our hammer. We don't have all the nails. Let's grab the nails. Excellent. We don't have the head crafted yet, so we, we need to craft a... Oh, no, did we make the... Yeah, we did make the head. There we go. Okay. That's what I thought. Derpin. Derpin. It's baked. It's ready to go. Okay, so that requires two, two. It's fine. We'll just grab some. I know it's getting dark now. I'll uh, stoke the fire. And try and keep the fire going here for us. Here, we'll just use these sticks. Come on. We can use these sticks. There we go. <clears throat> okay, so we'll get these going. So we have a axe head. And then we need to pound in these planks. So let's do that. And we've got the nails so we can build this thing. And as soon as the head pours, we can attach it. I mean, the sun went down. Okay, so we didn't beat the sun, but it's not quite. There we go. Tool workbench is done. And we have our head is done. And we'll grab that. And here, I'm just going to shut that off for now. I think off camera, I'm going to make heads, heads and handles for a whole bunch of wet, uh, tools. But I just wanted to do this here. And then <clears throat> I'm just going to leave this crap here for now. What Now, what you want to do is, oh, here, let's grab the handle. We have to put the handle in our main hand. Um, here, I'll put these nails there. And then we want to go to the tool workbench. We have to have the our our other thing available on the screen here, somewhere where we can grab it with our cursor. Cursor. So once we have the tool bench close enough, just hit E. It places it down, and you can just literally drag it 
onto it. Just like that, boom, we have our iron felling axe. Hit E to come back out of it, and there it is there. So you can see the damage on trees is maxed out now because we used the most damaging tree handle with the most damaging tree head. Um, so to chop down a tree now, I'm going to show you really quick. Here, let's grab grab a torch and we'll, we'll stoke that up. And I'll throw that in my backpack. Grab that. Okay. So we'll grab our new axe. I just want to show you this, how awesome the iron weapons are. So it was what, 14 hits? 14 hits against a broadleaf? One. Oh. No, that it's no, that's wrong. I must have been hitting it before. Okay, we'll just leave those logs here. Um, <laughs> here, I haven't hit this one. One, two, three, four, and five. Every single time, five. It's awesome. <laughs> and it lasts way longer. Eventually, the it'll get dull. You can sharpen it again with the grinder. Um, you can only sharpen the head so many times before you can't sharpen it anymore, though. Uh, you can replace the handle all like every time it breaks, it seems. So that's not a big deal. But but you can only sharpen the head so many times. But it lasts a long time, way longer than the stone stuff. And as you saw, it actually chops down the trees pretty darn quick. So now we have a way of gathering logs much faster. The next thing we're going to be doing is really quickly, I'm going to show you what I'm going to build off camera to help me gather wood and logs for the sawmill, which is going to be coming up pretty quick here. Uh, did I? It's it's a tool. That's why. There we go. So a small cart. I'll be I'll be uh, crafting a small cart here. We'll put it there right beside the uh, right beside that because I think it just needs plank two. Two one or two two meter planks. Boom! We'll have a small cart, and I'll show you that next episode. So next episode, uh, I think what we want to do is get uh, the basics. I'll have all my my iron tools ready to go. I'll have I'll have a bunch of resources ready to go, and we're gonna build the the foundation for a wood mill. A sawmill and build the sawmill and power it up. I think is going to be the it, that's kind of a lofty expectation too, but we I think we can do it. So this one's running along in the tooth. Sorry about that, guys. I'm going to call it here, but we have our iron weapon, our iron tools. So until next episode, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day. <laughs>